2020 has been a weird year and I know that's a cliche but it's true and I think it just got a lot weirder. Now the winter solstice is very auspicious being the longest night of the year because in ancient times the sun was very important. People relied on it for warmth, light and food so the winter was a very dangerous time to live and the winter solstice was the turning point where things would get better and the days would get longer. So celebrations took place and monuments to direct the light were built, most famously Stonehenge and Newgrange. So as you can tell ancient people were fascinated with natural cycles. Other natural cycles include meteor showers and planets aligning. Now I've done a bit of stargazing, I got a telescope a while back but I've never seen a meteor shower. And it just so happens tonight is the winter solstice and two very auspicious events are going to also take place. The aligning of Jupiter and Saturn for the first time in 397 years and the Ursid meteor shower. The Ursid meteor shower is called that because it originates from the constellation Ursa Major or the Great Bear. And if you're not familiar with Ursa Major, there's a myth. It starts with Callisto, a beautiful woman who caught the eye of, guess who, Zeus, the king of the gods. Unfortunately for Zeus, Callisto was part of the goddess Artemis's hunt, where immortality was the reward but maidenhood was the rule. And to make matters worse, Callisto was one of Artemis's most loyal followers. Wait a minute. Yeah, and in one of Zeus's most creepy and truly disgusting moves, he took on the appearance of Artemis herself. Then he tricked Callisto into coming close, and then, well. Afterwards, Zeus, true to his nature, completely abandoned Callisto at the scene. When Artemis found Callisto pregnant, she dispelled her from the hunt, and for months Callisto wandered the wilderness until she gave birth to her son Arcus. Hera, Zeus's wife, heard the baby's cries and discovering what had happened, transformed Callisto into a huge bear. Years later, Arcus, who had grown up, found a bear wandering in the forest and he was about to kill it when Zeus intervened. He set Callisto and her son Arcus in the sky as the constellations Ursa Major and Ursa Minor, which supposedly was a great honour. Hence, Ursid Meteor Shower. But also, as it happened, in the 17th century, a new moon was discovered by Galileo, and it was named Callisto, and it was one of Jupiter's moons, aka Zeus. And which planet is aligning with Saturn? Jupiter. Now, I am not superstitious, but I don't know, there's a connection here, and of course it's a coincidence, it has to happen sometime, but still. And even if it is a coincidence, that doesn't make it any less special or impressive, unless it's cloudy. So let me know in the comments below if you're gonna go out to see this amazing event in person. You don't need a telescope, only a dark high place, just don't go out alone. Hope you enjoyed this video, the first one in a month. Jeez, I'm, I'm sorry, but uh, like and subscribe, but I'll see you later. <laughs>